welcome back to my channel. So I just wanted to quickly jump on here and say hey and let you guys know that I'm just going to do lip swatches. Uh, this is the only time that I'm going to come in and talk to you guys about it. I'm just going to do a voiceover and let you guys know about the formula, why I like it. Just my little mini reviews of them and basically just show you what colors I do have on my lips. And yes, my lips are like so swollen. This is the last color that I swatched. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this video. Let me know if you guys have any questions down below, of course. And yeah, thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you in my next one. Love you. Bye. Hey, guys. So for our first gloss, we are going in with L'Oreal Infallible Pro Matte Glosses. And I have three shades here. There are 10 total. And I'm just going to say it off the bat that these are my favorite out of the three. I love these so much. They're super comfortable. They have that whipped, velvety feel to the lips. Like when you rub them together, it feels so nice and comfortable. The pigmentation was amazing. It just glided on my lips so beautifully. These didn't dry out my lips. Now keep in mind, I do moisturize my lips before I apply this. And it wore beautifully throughout the day. This does fade, of course. It didn't last me all day or anything like that, but it did give me like a good two, three hours. By the third hour, of course, I needed to reapply it if I wanted it to look like when I first applied it. And I didn't have any trouble with this transferring. It just sat comfortably on my lips, and I think you need to try these right now if you haven't yet. And uh, as far as the finish, I don't know if I said it already, but it is a pro matte. Matte satin, because of the glossiness, it's not, a uh, very, very true, true, true matte, but definitely a must try. And yes, moving on to the next color. Here we have the, which one is this? Uh, blushing Ambition. And I didn't think, I haven't worn pinks in a really long time and I actually really liked this pink. I thought it would look really pretty in the springtime. And I actually liked with this makeup that I had on right now. And yes, the formula, I'm just telling you guys, you need to try this stuff. <laughs> All right, and up next we are trying out the Revlon Ultra HD Matte Lip Color. And now with these, they weren't my favorite. And now let me just say this, it's because I use these back to back from the L'Oreal ones. When applying these, they needed several coats to get the true color and they were much glossier than I anticipated. I was just seeing matte and I'm like, okay, I want them to be matte, but it, I, I would say these are more uh, glossy and have a sheen to them. Uh, these weren't uncomfortable or anything on the lips. They go on the uh, lips nicely, but um, they transferred and they kind of feathered and I just needed to apply these more carefully to uh, make the color more even and look nice on my mouth. And now I'm saying this in comparison to L'Oreal's. L'Oreal's was much easier to apply on my mouth and I really liked the formula of the L'Oreal's better than the Revlon's. And that's not to say that these ones aren't beautiful, but they weren't my favorite in the bunch. I honestly, I would just try one of them and skip out. You don't need more than one. <laughs> and the last lip product is the Revlon Matte Balms. Now these aren't new, but these shades are new and I've never tried these before so when I saw the sign I was like ooh excited and I absolutely love these they're exactly what they say they're a matte balm they kind of feel velvety when I rub my lips together I felt like my lips were moisturized when I wore these and they were really comfortable and there's also 11 shades of this and I would totally buy more of these I have two of them and I actually like both of these shades and yes, isn't that a beautiful nude color? But yes, I think the Revlon Matte Balms are a total try. I really, really liked these a lot. They were super comfortable and I think they'd be perfect for every day. All right, you guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know down below if you guys like lip swatch videos and if you liked it like this. I can do more videos where I include more than one lip swatch review, but if you'd like it to be just one, let me know and I will definitely do that next time. But yes, thanks for watching guys. I'll see you in my next video. Love you. Bye.